Today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Star Spirits of Good Wishes. But in a way that you really might not have heard it before, and in a way that you will never hear it again. That's, uh, it's a different, it's a different menu music than what you'd normally be listening to. That's a little odd. That's a little weird. Hey guys, welcome to Paper Mario Randomizer. We are running the Randomizer 0 0.21.0 beta. I am using the seed, cookbook, bump attack, uh, calculator, and one of them, like, go faster drinks. I don't actually know the name of it. I'm not... I know Paper Mario, I would say, almost like the back of my hand, but you'll also notice on the side of the screen there, we've got a handy-dandy tracker. Um, what I have turned on at the moment is we are randomizing a whole bunch of stuff. I don't know if you can see my... Yeah. So I believe that this is Shop Sanity, Ralph Sanity, uh, that'll also be Star Pieces are included, E Sanity, Item Box Sanity, Environmental Sanity, oh no, that's Star Pieces included, so then that's the Star Piece Shop. It's gonna get a little weird. The only thing that I haven't turned on that would be included in like a full Insanity run is... Uh, regular laying around the overworld coins, because that adds in a lot of weird checks that I don't like doing. Um, let's see what else. And I've also, in this randomizer version, we have random music. So this is a fun first track, and it looks like we're starting with Lackey Lester. Handy that. And of course... Everyone's colors are changed around. I don't have any additional starting items. Uh, we do have the Homeward Shroom, which just one tiny bite brings sweet homes of memory, or sweet memories of home, which lets us uh, just zip back to Toad Town anytime we need to. And yeah, it's just a go beat decrease of the attack damage that Mario takes by one. That's handy. Um, Badges have a random number of BP. I don't know if that is what it is in the original. Because again, I've kind of lost track playing a lot of Paper Mario Randomizer these days. Having a good time. That was just a regular coin. That could have been uh, any item. It could have been a partner. It could have been anything. Oh yeah, I've shuffled the partners into the item pool. So that's fun. And um, yeah, we're just doing the general checks. Now you'll notice that I have um, I don't have things open. Um, here, I'll, I'll show that off one more time. So, like, I can't go to the prologue right now. But when I walk into this screen, it shows me that I didn't get the star piece here. And it also, where the star pieces are hidden, uh, have misaligned textures. Hey! Speaking of, we got what? That opens up Yoshi's Island. Okay. And prologue, I can click off doing those. Toad Town, I can get rid of you. I need to go and check what we've got in the items. Oh yes, I guess I do start with one thing. I start with 100 coins, and there's a very good reason to want to start with 100 coins in this randomizer. Um, so that you don't have to go grinding really early on uh, in case there's something that you really need behind uh, shop progression. And I guess I can check what's over here. Do I want... It's just a coin. Uh, sushi panel. Don't need it. Oops. I see my mouse over there. I don't need that. Okay, what do I want from the shop? Hey, repel gel's on sale. And... Just buy me the hammer upgrade right off the bat. So we're going to not be able to do a lot with that. I don't need any of this stuff right away, but I will remember that it's there. Which means I won't be ticking off my shop. I still can't get panels with the super hammer. I need the ultra hammer for that. Ah, yes, another thing. Chuck Quizmo just gives you a star piece. 
Um, we should really go in. Ah! And I've included trap items. Like, ooh, I get a health up. No, no, definitely don't get a health up. So, there is that. I just want to get you back in your house because I don't have super jump. I don't have a spin jump yet. Let's save after that blunder. Uh, do I have anything that I can really get? Yeah, I got that. That was a trap. Mm -hmm. Welcome to ticking items off of a spreadsheet. Um, fire shield? I don't want. I don't need the cake mix. You got anything else? Please just refresh your shop so I can see everything that you have. You should have four items. And you got... I don't want to buy all of these checks just yet, because there might be something great hiding around the corner. I'll need them in a minute. There we go. This guy, Kent, is there right off the bat. But one-time payment of 50 coins gets him out of the way. And this guy is a real pain to be dealing with. So we have saved. All right. Um, do I want... I kind of don't want what. Ah, you'll notice that Goomba had seven health. Ooh, we've got some jazzy music. So, yes, um, the the chapter difficulties, as I can select over here, that wouldn't be Eldstar, would it? Yes, it would be Eldstar. I can indicate, you know, just how hard I think they are. There is, like, an actual breakdown you can get by telling, like, what enemies HP are. You have to, it's, it's a whole friggin' spreadsheet, but this is... A uh, really hard chapter if Goombas have seven health right off the bat. And are doing four damage each. Um. You know what? It's not worth it. It's just not worth it. We are getting out of there. We are dropping our coins. Ah, I can't get that coin. Okay. Uh, you'll notice that I also have Speedy Spin just equipped naturally. Just for for movement's sake, I have turned on a lot of quality of life improvements. Like I said, so you can tell when you're when you're in a spot that needs a uh, 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 star piece. Still, you have faster movement, so you're not. You're not stuck slow walking everywhere. Um, so right off the bat, I want to check a couple more things that the randomizer, the randomizer has included outside of just regular checks that you would do, is we've changed how star pieces work. Oh, this is a song you don't hear often. Ah, useless check. Yeah, that's a really obvious panel piece right there. So, let's see, let's see. They have reworked recently. I don't know how recently, I, I should say. This this wasn't in a previous, the, the, the previous version of the randomizer that I had spent a lot of time with, was how the badge system worked with your star piece rewards. Oh, you're nice and pink today. Hey, what's up? Okay. Yes, yeah, so there's check rewards. Every 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 star pieces that you spend, you'll get a reward. One of them is the storeroom key, which could have four checks behind it. So I need to at least have 25 star pieces. Alternatively, your rewards are close call a life shroom... Nothing that I actually need to trade star pieces for. Okay. Um. I might as well get close call. Like, I'm, I'm here. I've got the one star piece. I don't remember where I got the one. No, I got it from Chuck Quizma. Okay. Yeah, just one. Might as well. Oh, or heart pieces automatically restore. Uh, I will go with that for now. So first off, I need to be finding, like, enemies that I can actually damage. 
And I guess I should tick you off. And you'll notice that my mouse is gigantic here because of how far zoomed out I have to be using this web app version. So it fits nice and cropped on the side of my screen. I hope y'all are welcome. Uh, I'm just now noticing these big black borders around everything in Paper Mario. Sorry, I had to pause there real quick. Right off the bat on a recording, just needing to do some uh, rejiggering. Okay. Okie doke. So we've taken care of that. Central Plaza. Right, now, now I know what is at stake for buying. I am going to start spending my money according. So I do need star pieces, that would be useful. But I know what's locked behind a star piece. What I am going to instead take is a cookbook. Ugh, I only got 15 coins left, okay. Ah, I should have checked the, ah, I should have checked the, the secondary shop. I was like, oh, well, I'll get the cookbook so I can trade that in right off the bat. Didn't think about order of operations here. Chase. Um, let's get this bulb. What could you have in store for me? You got a mystery, nothing I need. Uh, now, there are items. Uh, most of what you will be buying or, or receiving for checks in this, you'll also want to then pump into money. There's going to be, we're going to be put, pressed for cash early on and flush with it later. Take a cookbook. I also have just the fastest talk speed imaginable. But Tasty is still missing her. Uh, missing her cookbook. Or her uh, frying pan, so we can't do anything. Yes, I saw the boo. I just wanted to get these cutscenes out of the way. Out of the way. There's not anything hiding in this tree, is there? No. Okay, I, I just am kind of on a in, in, instinctual smack everything. I don't need to go down there to the games room. Thankfully, nothing is hidden behind the games room. Is there nothing here? No. No, there's nothing here that I can grab then. And there's nothing behind the friggin' pigs. Oh my god, I'm glad that we don't have to do anything with the pigs. Um. Ralph didn't have anything I needed, right? I will go back and double check. Oh man, the, the other problem with doing like a test play run of this tracker with all of the new things that are randomized is like, I'm forgetting, ah, ah, that is important. Is that more? Yeah, I kind of need that right now. I don't need the letter. I do need three letters before I can do the check for uh, dried or in in uh, Mount Rugged with Paracarry. Which could be holding anything, right? Like, that's, th when Paracarry joins your party, he could actually instead give you, like, the Ultra Stone, or what have you. And what else do we have over here? Hey, here's another thing that I've shuffled around. Normally this is a 10 coin block, it's now actually an upgrade, because 10 coins and upgrade blocks can be shuffled into each other. Um, and I can upgrade any party member, not just the ones that I have with me. Uh, uh, cloud nine to avoid enemy attacks. I do have Watt, which is useful. I think I'd actually rather take Lackey Lester. Oh, what am I going to need? What am I going to want? I think we're going to go with Watt off the bat. Because again, I don't, I don't know what... Or I could just immediately bumble into another party member that I, that I want even more. Things that I also forgot to show off is that... Uh, party member. Hey, Turbo Shock, or Power Shock and Turbo Charge are one 
flower point each, which is handy. Spiny shard is two flower points. Uh, they're they're randomized. We have committed. I grabbed the cookbook, not the lyrics. Did we see the lyrics somewhere? Shit, I need to also be. That's lyrics. Some of the other ones that I have. I thought I had cookbook. There we go. And did that. I haven't grabbed any more key items yet, have I? No, we're good. Need to be remembering that I'm not keeping track of key items. And you've got one... One letter. Harbor. No, oh, I didn't talk to Simon either. I'm the worst, because he gives you the lyrics to start with. I am the worst. I am the worst at doing checks and keeping... Keeping track of everything. You don't need to be... Don't need to be yelling at me. Well, th this is definitely a song to hear. Thank you for writing me out the lyrics. What actually did you give me? Magical seed, eh? Useful. Okay, so Simon's done. Your six items... Well, I should leave that on because I do still kind of need... Ah, and I did take care of the bowl. I don't need anything else from the main gate shop, right? We we took care of everything there. No, I need star pieces from there, potentially. I uh, got anything else. It was... Ah, you have the lyrics. Okay, yeah, so no. I do need... Do need Ralph's four items. Okay. All of the prologue view is open because, again, we have the super hammer now. So now I can go into the sewers. Ooh. Do, 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 do. Yes, and I have saved and I have, I've got enough health. Okay. So I'm going to have to do some stupid... I'm going to have to do the blooper fight is what I'm going to have to do. I guess I can check this... So, the way that the bloopers work in Super Mario, or, or Paper Mario, um... Oh! I won't say no to an upgrade block. One, the sewer enemies aren't uh, randomized, and hey, that's... I would rather have that. Mega Smash hammers an enemy with a huge amount of attack power. How much? 5 FP, so I only get to use this once. So these guys are only as strong as, as they will be. So you can at least always grind in the sewers if need to. If you need to. They're never going to scale un unnaturally. Uh, which party member do I want to upgrade? And now I will upgrade Lackey Lester. Yes, you are the correct one. That ah, Couldn't get out. Couldn't get out in time. Uh, I should be able to beat these guys, right? Should being the operative word, right? Just mash that stick. Oh, and don't, uh, don't jump on them. Use your hammer, because it is already strong for now. Your jump will become incredibly strong later when you have badges and, and all sorts of things. But at least we're getting some star points off the bat. Uh, there is a, a lot of different scaling options that you can have in this randomizer. Enemies scale to match your level, which I find completely unnecessary. And right, I don't want to do this last check in the Toad Town Tunnels. We got you. Doing the shrink, sh bleh, the shrink stomp check would require you to fight a blooper. And the way the blooper fights work is that those always scale. The first blooper you fight is the level one. The second blooper you fight is the super blooper. And then it's like the charge blooper or the ultra blooper. I forget. But 
So if I can put off doing that Shrink Stomp check, I will never have to fight the worst fight for the bloopers. Now, I say worst fight for the bloopers, I've already got Watch, which means that bloopers serve no, no fear whatsoever. Bloopers ain't nothing. Um, because I can just stun lock them. For some reason, bloopers are great to stun lock capabilities or candidates. Ugh. Words no work good when randomized. Oh, I'm looking at, I'm looking at my preview screen for what it's worth. That whole time I'm talking off axes and staring over there, trying to make sure that I actually am like looking at my tracker. I, honestly, if that's the case, I should just move everything to where I need it to be. Okay. Um, we save. We're good. Blooper. <laughs> I got you. Uh, this is Shiver? I want to say? Um, Power Shock. And yeah, just A. So this is going to take a while, is what it's going to do. But this then opens up. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, I fucked that up. I forgot what I was doing. But this then opens up the, the dry, dry desert. We can approach Mount Rugged from the backwards way by going through the desert and then falling down. We don't need paracarry. Um, unfortunately, my hammer power up here doesn't... Ah! Uh... Yeah, honestly, turbocharge makes life easier for me. And I have health I can spend on this, if need be. Um, Power Shock. This is a repeatedly... Repeatedly. Repeatedly. Um, it opens the prologue, which could be a lot of useful checks. This, this opens a lot for me. And it allows me to get to Koopa Village without having to, you know, go through... <laughs> Enemies that I couldn't even beat a Goomba and a Fuzzy. Yeah, we got this. See, these fights are no joke with... No jokes when you actually have Watt. Uh, which I'm glad I have. I could have started with Bombette and then not found the Ultra Hammer and... Or Super Hammer and just... Out look! A moment here, a moment of the dojo reprieve. Uh, go and save before. Well, go to Prologue. Go to Prologue. We are in the Goomba Village. So talk to Goombario, Goomba, Goompa, and get all of these. Hey! Oh, that was real! Okay. Did I get good badge luck this time? Did I get good badge luck? No, I didn't! Badges are more expensive, so... I can't cheese stats high yet. Or at least flower points. Maybe, right, because the one that I got for the health point was fake. Oh, I didn't actually say yes to half any of the uh, Thunderbolt, I'll take that. And I would rather have... Want out once more. Uh, oh, I don't have the dolly yet. What do we have in the tree? Trees and bushes that have things also sparkle now. Isn't that nice? Isn't that lovely? Uh, Grandpa, you were gonna give me a thing. It's a star piece. I'm not gonna say no to that. What else do you got here on your balcony? It's a stopwatch. That's just money, because I don't really ever need a stopwatch. Watch for that if need be. Unless I do need it. But I probably don't. But what if I do? But I probably don't. 
Um, Goompa, did you have anything for me? No. Let's... Let's hit up the save point. Or let's hit up the... Uh, in to refresh, and then save. Ins in Paper Mario are free. There is no cost to ever retreating to go and heal yourself. To full, as opposed to Thousand Year Door, where even the heal blocks out in the overworld steal your coins. Going to see Mario is not going to be helpful. Um, let's poke our head into the prologue and see what's what. How strong are you? I didn't even get a first strike. I, I swear I pressed B. Very strong! Prolog you! Very bad! Block this nonsense! You'll also notice that I'm dropping my experience when I run away now. So that's cool. Okay, we do not go there. We do keep hitting Chuck Quizmo, who I also have as like a forced spawn, so that I just naturally build up piece or uh naturally build up those rather than having to run around to find him because why did I attack you? you just fucking run away. God damn it. You would give me so much experience if I could beat you, but literally one round of attacks from these guys would kill me. So there goes all that blooper experience we got. For what it's for what little that's worth. I would rather you did it, motherfucker. Yo. Ah, you can get me from down there. You can fall off the ledge. God. This is the worst. I am losing all money. Yo. Oh, that is just sad. Sad is what it is. Got an egg. Oh, if these guys are rough, I guess there goes me ever hope of beating Junior Troopa. Hey, I can get this first time. Ah! I needed a key! I needed a key, goddammit! Oh, we didn't even, didn't even lose help. Well, if that block is right there, and I can find an early game battle, Power Smash hammers an enemy using a lot of attack power. What do I want instead? So Mega Smash does way more damage for 5 FP. This only takes 2 SP or FP, but it's 7 whole bad points. That's that's two more levels up, dude. It's not it was not happening. I could get I could fight one of them enemies. So, I'm going to I'm going to pull a dirty trick here. And instead of leaving the oh Another upgrade block before we have another party member. I'm going to... I want Bombette leveled up. I just always want Bombette leveled up. Uh, because then I have a, like, strong all-enemy attack. Um, even though I have Paracarry right now, who's cheap. But I think Bombette's strong. Just, like, right out the gate. Two whole items. But yeah, I'm gonna play a dirty trick, and instead of leaving this the normal way and triggering the Junior Troopa, I'm gonna Homeward Shroom. Ah, I thought that was the Ultra Stone, which would have let me start double leveling people, because I've also hidden the Ultra Stone somewhere, which uh, is a rude trick to... Oh! Ah, shit, my inventory's full. So I am wasting money here by throwing away a coconut. So I need to go sell or check some things. Bump attack? Okay, no, that's the fake one. No, it's a real one. It's not something I'll be able to equip. I don't want a dried shroom. I mean, I could eat it. Sadly, there's no... So that's... That's all of everything. Yes, I save for safety's sake. Because, yeah, there's no way I'm beating Junior Troop if, if a regular Goomba's got seven... Uh, seven... Oh, man, that means... Okay. So, clicking over here. We got those two. We got these. I didn't get the panel. I'm gonna need to come back for the panel. Uh, it just says all of them. That's handy. Okay. And Goomba Village. We got Gumbario, Goomba, 
veranda, tree, and foliage coin. But yeah, I, I don't want to go in exploring here because these guys will kick my ass. And getting to the Goomba tree left of the fortress, there could be an incredibly great item there that is behind what's going to be a pretty tough boss, honestly, at this point. So instead, we are just homeward shrooming. 